Okay, we had a leak at this valve. These valves are always a problem. I really don't even like having these valves in here. Uh, this is one of the uh, issues you deal with when you deal with a gas chain. If you have, say, a leak in this valve, well, you're going to have to fix it. Well, these valves are a tapered type valve. And uh, oftentimes, if they haven't been moved for a long time and you go to move them, they'll start leaking. And I'm always a little antsy about leaving these valves in here. I will sometimes pull this out and check it and uh, maybe put a little bit of grease on it but uh, it all you know it all comes in to this thing is many many years old and there's a lot of things on it that simply can stop working or give trouble so you got to check everything in these things uh, this is uh, this is kind of a tough one here Okay, I'm going to pull this valve apart because we had a leak in, in it. There. Oh. And you can see it's a taper. Uh, there's supposed to be a grease on it. I don't usually carry the grease with me. Uh, I don't really want to fix these things very bad anyway. Uh, but I will try a little bit of grease on it and we'll see what uh, some general purpose type grease will do for it. Okay, I've re uh, greased this plunger, tried to spread it around pretty good, make sure this is absolutely clean. Put it back in there like that and then tighten it down. You don't want it real tight when you do this uh, or you'll uh, end up with uh, a problem with uh, it won't turn. Again, I really don't want to say that I'm uh, advocating this because this is something you'd do if you had no other choice. If you did want to keep the gas chain in this case, you could use a butterball valve or something like that. Uh, and uh, that would, uh, a butterball will never hardly leak, so it turns. Let's, we'll see if it's going to uh, hold pressure. It appears that it is holding. Uh, so it's not leaking. Uh, what your choice here is pretty much throw the valve away, which I think if I did that, I would just probably throw the whole gas chain away, or you can fix it. Uh, like I said, I'm not really advocating you fix these things. Uh, it's something you'd do if you had to. Um, I don't even carry the, the grease that's made for these things, although lubricating grease does actually seem to work okay. Each time one of these is opened, um, if you have to leave it in there, make sure you leak check it. Uh, because they're they're bad leakers.